Hey everyone, Deadpan here. Welcome back to Hardcore Tarkov, episode 58 here. We're going to hop right into a factory raid for Hatchet Run. We're going to try to do Postman Pat with this one, though. Oh, we're probably just going to die, but that's that's how these uh, Hatchet Runs go. And we'll see you on raid. Alright, here we go. Like I said, we're probably going to die, but that's okay. Nice little warm-up here. Nice little warm-up here. Okay, this is actually pretty good. If he can make it to us. It's two. Why aren't you dying? I hit him in the head two times. Were those not headshots? Like, I'm very confused as to how those aren't headshots. We hit it, like, I was like, all right, cool, got him. Cool, got him. Cool, got him. I got three hit count. So it had to have been arms, right? That had to have been arms. There's no other possible explanation. Wow. Oh, that's such a bummer. Hmm. Again. All right, here we go. Again. I do like how we're, like, a minute and a half into recording. It's already taken us 20 minutes to do it. Okay. Oh, nice. I don't know what door they're coming through. He walked through a door! <laughs> he walked through a door! Are you kidding me? I guess you can't go through that door that I was looking on the left there, so I should have been there. That stinks. I can't, I can't believe he walked through a door. Like, I can't do that, and he can do that? Like, come on. Come on. Alright, we're not going to do that again. Um, I, I would like to do that again, but um, we're going to go in with a kit to get Postman Pat done. <laughs> Uh, I would like to get Postman Pat done. So, I'm trying to think what we bring in here. Uh, probably one of these AK-74s with just some PP rounds. We're not we're not worried about we're not worried about much here. Um, get the tunes going. I had to organize the stash a little bit just to fit some stuff. Don't know if I want to wear that. Let me get those things sold here real quick. Oh, and check our dailies and check our dailies. Cause that's a fun little warm up, but yeah, let's check. Let's check these guys. What do we got here? We got tests. We got elimination scavs on shoreline. I uh, should be able to replace it for that later. Interesting that I could replace it for euros. Do believe I will be doing that. Horse figurine chain link gold neck chain. Honestly, that's a that's a decent chunk of rubles for all of this. Not the best experience, but I'm pretty okay with that. It's good skier rep. And I'm pretty happy with that. We can also sell these or just use that, honestly. Okay. Exit shoreline through pier boat and exit interchange through Emercom. Okay, the ones that don't take rep to replace, I will be absolutely replacing. Extract through Emercom. Um, sure. Oh. Okay. That's really, really important. Oh, that happened to us last wipe, didn't it? That one's like less so. All right. Oh, well, I guess we're going to interchange. Let's get Postman Pat done real quick, but then we're going to go to interchange for sure. Um... Yeah, no, that's really important. Oh, I put those two Glocks up there. That's right. Okay. Let me just do this real quick. Look at that. I think I think the ZevTech is one of the best slides you can get for Glocks. Do I have bullets for this is the question. Let 
No, I do not. Okay. Wasn't sure. I don't really like them anyway. So I'm really not too worried about it. Beautiful. Okay. So we need to do Postman Pat. Uh, honestly, that's pretty good. We'll just wear that thing. Yeah, that seems good. Then we're going to go ahead. I, I kind of need, like, I don't really need a backpack, but I do need a rig. I guess we could do this rig. Barters. Just waiting for the day we actually run out of those. <laughs> it's entirely possible. Oh, Voss for, for that thing's actually not terrible. Oh, Moonshine? Oh, no, that's that's not a good one. So Akamari's and Sugar for that guy, which is actually a, reason, a very reasonable uh, barter. That one's never in stock, but that one has a lot of nice parts on it. Yeah. Okay. Mercom. So I've seen this... this, this What's the right word? I, a rusted something bloody key where you can get all of these keys for on streets. I do want to do some streets raids soon and just like see what we can do. Because we're playing hardcore anyway, so it's like basically the same thing there. I know. Hmm. Yeah, because going to streets and getting some Bitcoin would actually be real nice for those. And that is interesting. That is interesting. So I'm pretty sure this is like, and we have this already, but I'm pretty sure this is like the AKS build we got to do next. We really got to find, we're, sorry, we're not find. We got to get this forward to shift as well. Which is basically just getting this barter going, which is filing cabinets and computers. The the hardcore the hardcore Tarkovs, you know, we do this for life. <laughs> Nothing but filing cabinets and uh, <laughs> and computers. Okay, let's do. We're gonna do three, I think. Because these are important. Do I have any BS left? I don't. Let's just do that. And then we're going to top up this. Top up this. Could do BP as well, but I'm not as worried about that. I do want the... because Because we're trying to complete a task, I do want that out there. Um... Sure. Just to be able to top load with, I guess. We're, we're, our goal is to not top load. Um, okay. I think this is good. We've got that. We've got that. Maybe I'm propotoling as well. Let's check our hideout real quick as well. <clears throat> hey, hey, Amir. How you doing today? So what is Tarkov? Finally, like had that looting simulator and a lot of opening of drawers. I, You know... Yes. Yes, it is. And I like it. What do we have here? Getting this going would actually be really good. And these are... You can actually... If you get some vodka, you can actually craft a ton of these. And, like, this... This is definitely worth investing into. And then you could even convert them into AFAX. But that's not, almost not even worth it. That's actually pretty good, too. It's two of them as well? Dang. Once we get the, um... Epsilon, like... Grizzly plus CMS plus that, it like, it takes care of so many problems. Like, injector case, you know? Super good. Okay, our, our flash drives are done. I didn't really need them. I just wanted to give this something to craft for a long time. And what did I craft here? Oh, I crafted more PP rounds. That's right. Okay. I don't think there's anything I really want to craft right now. Maybe in here? No, we, have, we finished that bleach craft. Yeah, we're gonna look, keep an eye out for these six items. Okay. How close are we to Epsilon? We are four or five. So we're three tasks away. We're halfway through part four. The problem is these three tasks are very difficult and hard to do. All right, let's go get Postman Pat done. 
I'll see you, Raid. All right, here we go. Remember, this is in full auto or not. It's not. I think this is just a flashlight. We're actually relatively close to where we need to be. Uh, which is nice. Okay, so this is Postman Pat. Grab the letter. Somebody's going ham over there. Oh, please be contacts. Bot scavs have not had... Oh, I forgot to take my knife off. The bot scavs have not had, um... Bags lately. Which is weird. I actually need that. I'm just gonna loot my way out to this exit. We don't need this anymore. One of your factory key exits. No, I'm not talking about player scavs, K Bailey. Or let's talk about the scavs you've killed. I'm just talking about, like, yeah, the bot scavs. Like, they've just been, they usually, they always came with the backpack before, and now they just don't seem to. Maybe, maybe that's what you're saying. All right, GG. That was good. Quick, easy, got our experience, got in, got out. Um, shouldn't be a run through. Yeah, more than enough. Um, and we get to finish the task. Good stuff. All right. Let's make sure my music's going here. The Vaseline was actually good because I accidentally used one of those. <laughs> what do you do? Part of a thick case. We're not never going to get to that. I almost want to try this camper axe at some point. Oh, interesting. So toothpaste is half of a car kit. I know that's a little bit weird, but... Those are all totally fine. This is getting sold. This is getting sold. This is getting sold. Uh, that was a good one to get, though. I like that. We don't need this at the moment. Those did something weird. I don't remember what. I'll put them down below here. It's a lot of PP rounds. Okay. Uh, sugar has good crafts now. Let's get these sold up. Gotta hit that with a repair. Okay. I mean, we're not like rich, but you know, we're not not out of it yet. Okay, we gotta hand this into therapist. This might actually unlock something as well. Oh, sorry, like unlock a task here, maybe. Obtain the registered mail on the streets of Tarkov. I've not done that one. It does give us a 6B47, which is going to be relevant for the next, um, the next thing. Next uh, Punisher task. Oh, yeah, that's pretty good. Huh. Oh, I, can, I might be able to just equip that from this. Hold on. Beautiful. Okay, so. We got Postman Pat done. I forgot what I was gonna work on next after that. It was something it was something silly. No, no. Oh right, we need to do sorry, we need to do this because I need these green batteries real bad. Uh this one. So yeah, out through Embercon. So we gotta do a bunch of so let's I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go add up with Twitch chat here. What all of my um, tasks on 
interchange are. We're going to use this 74N instead of the AK. I'm going to save that for office kills. Probably just going to use PP rounds here. I don't think there's a way I'm going to be able to put a flashlight on this, huh? That's a bit rough. I really want to be able to put a I'm going to go daytime. I just, I really want to be able to put a flashlight on here. Um, but I don't think we're going to be able to do that. And you know what? That's okay. That's okay. I'd still rather have this. We're going to, you know, go in relatively undergeared here. And that's okay. We're going to make this a plum version, because why not? Don't have that, but we... Uh, we don't have that either. But we do have... That. Yeah, and that's it. We're just going to bring a stock AK-74N in. No problem. That's getting sold. That's getting folded. And then that's going to keep the good mags in. This is just... We're just going to use a bunch of PP rounds here. We're not even going to use that. Uh, we don't, That said, though, we don't even really need this. While on... Um... Splint is what I need. We don't even really need that while we're on here. Uh, like keys, I mean. Could put another propotol there. We don't really have a CMS though, so the propotol doesn't even really get all that good. I think I'm just gonna do that. We're just gonna do that, and then we're gonna do maybe look for meds. But yeah, that'll be our healing. That's good. That's good. That's good. Uh, filter by item here. We do need to do. I, I know for a fact we're going to need to do mini bus. So I'm just going to grab two more of these and fill up on that. Oh, I need to do a um, a Wi-Fi camera as well. For at uh, what's its face, Kibba. All right, cool. That's going to be our kit. Uh, I gotta. I am going to go look up the task though, just to make sure we have a list of things we need to do. And uh, I will see you all in interchange. What was that load in time? A little dead pine late spawn here? 30 seconds? My goodness. Oh, I also forgot water. Pop Juarez, 100 month. The other day, tier I saw a baguette in a cage. Three it was sub. in captivity. Oh, my goodness. Pop, thank you so much. Seriously, for tier three and 100 months of subage. That is extremely epic of you i really appreciate it oh you know what though we're we're not trying to get out here we need to take emercom out okay i am starting to care about these a little bit more but not that not that much not that much I can't believe how fast that loading was, though. But, uh, YouTube, thanks for tuning in. Pop, thanks for the Tier 3. That's our, uh, actually our first sub today. Pretty gosh darn epic one. Just gonna grab everything here. We need the UV light bulbs. Honestly, green batteries can spawn in these as well. Screws are actually pretty good right now because I really want to start trading for these pretty consistently. The Calyx. Calyx. Um, cigarettes have some good trades as well. So. Make sure full auto here. This one may be a railway exit, but it may be Emercom. I don't know. Good morning, Jed Levy. Happy Friday. You should actually check. It is Emercom. Classic. Oh, do need a couple of those. That's the thing. is like a couple helixes. Among other things, actually need to set aside one of those as well. Will get us.
um, more upgrades in our hideout. Not that we really need them, but another upgrade to our weapon rack would be kind of cool. Although at this stage, with Stash 3 installing, it's not as important. But I, I think it would be a cool accomplishment to get done for sure. I think technically right now I actually need PSUs, <laughs> Jed Levy. To be fair, the PSUs would be for the GPUs, but I'm not super concerned with it. Yeah, I'm actually excited about the, the Pestley Kappa speedrun as well. This will be out long after that's done. <laughs> uh, YouTube, but yeah, that I always enjoy those. It's kind of got me like that. That that speed run has me feeling like I would like to um, play the standard account and like you know go for Kappa this wipe, which I have not done in a very long time. So that might be what the Hatchet Man challenge ha became. You know, originally I was thinking of all these extra rules for the Hatchet Man challenge. But the Hatchet Man Challenge might just be like Hatchet to hatch to Kappa type of thing that we do live streams for. <clears throat> Good morning, uh, Angel League. How are you? Do cap and X-Wipe? I might. I might. I, it depends on timing and stuff. Like, I, I just... Um, the thing is, I don't have a ton of Minecraft backed up on my plate right now. I know I know. I said at the start of, like, playing Sky Vaults that I really wanted to do some speed runs. I haven't really been in the mood. I just haven't really been in the mood much for Minecraft at, at the moment. I, I'm still enjoying it, don't get me wrong. But lately, I've just been more in the mood to play Tarkov and really immerse myself in Tarkov with multiple playthroughs and multiple styles. So. I don't know. It's a we will see. We will see. No, there will be a lot more downtime that way, but I know. I know. But, like, here's the thing, Simon. I, I, I get the timing makes sense then, but I'm not going to be in the mood for that then. Right? Oh, wow. That's actually... We need three for one and one for the other. Actually, need a second one of those as well. Okay. Oh yeah, no, for sure. This is it is with Minecraft, and I, that's the other thing is like, that's how I, how so I've been saying, uh, talking about Tarkov right now is how I feel about Minecraft right now. It's like I want to wait until I have time to do it to that extent, because I've been thinking about popping onto a few you know packs that we don't have to worry about. How well we're doing, that sort of thing. Just sort of chilling, messing around, etc. I think we're actually good on those. Would like this bottle of JD. We don't need this, 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 this. Uh, those are actually important for alpha containers. I don't know if we need capacitors. This is an armor, though. Fair enough. 
I, I probably could take a stab as to why. But I don't know if I want to do that, you know? Ooh. Hello. I don't think we need those. But you know what? You know what? I'm, I would be really excited for Angel for Minecraft. I would love to start fresh, and I'm and I'm. But I I don't want to with uh, with Vault Hunters. But I do, I want to wait till it all comes out. I want there to be a okay. We're not doing any more mechanic changes. We might tweak stuff, but mechanically everything's going to be the same, right? Where are you? Help! Scab tried to ambush me. Um, but yeah. I want to wait till there's like a... I guess I'll wear that. Um... It's it's fully released type of thing, but I'm, I'm excited for a restart there. But the the thing with that is though, is like I don't want to like sacrifice a series that we have. I want to finish that series, but then the the future series that we do maybe aren't YouTube series, you know? Maybe they're just VOD series. I don't know. I got to figure it out. It's. Something's definitely feeling burnt or I'm tired of, and I'm not exactly sure what it is. Gotta, gotta, gotta do some soul searching on that one. That's, that's kind of where I was coming from, Simon. I would, my, my initial reaction to that was, um, most other streamers' hardcore series. I'm not saying names for YouTube purposes. And this is not just the person we're talking about. It's a challenge run after their main account. So, this is my main account. This is exciting to get stuff done because this is, you know, if if this if this character were to not wipe, I would be going for Kappa on this account, on this run through, you know? While I don't think all the other streamers that we're talking about here who do hardcore would be doing that, like, the only other person I know that started day one of the wipe was last wipe with Sheaf and Josh OG. They did a, they did a, they were doing a speed run though of hardcore. They weren't doing like hardcore, hardcore. And they, it was just a 30 day challenge. So like a lot of people who do hardcore, it's a challenge as something extra to do. This is my main account. This is how I play Tarkov, right? And if I do a standard account to hatch it to Kappa run, that's the challenge account, you know? And that I think that I think when it's your main account, it does change how you play. I care more about building guns. I care more about long term effects. I care more about that. And also, it also could just be my playstyle too. But I think that's why it feel, it feels different, you know. And I'm glad people enjoy it. I am, you know. I absolutely love watching all those other streamers play hardcore. That's my favorite way to watch Tarkov. I don't I don't I like I enjoy some of the late game tasks to watch because I'm I don't get to those. But watching XYZ streamer do, you know, shootout picnic for the hundredth time is just, that's not exciting to me anymore. So watching them do it in hardcore is exciting because you just don't know what they're going to get, you know? So, yeah. Vault Hunters been on the end game since how they developed it too. So Vault Hunters will have the end game. They, they, they are develop developing that currently, Wazian. So I... My, what I'm saying is I don't want to restart a world or, like, do a second second run-through just for funsies like a lot of other content creators have until that content is there, you know? So, all right. How are we doing this? <laughs> Once again, we are loaded with stuff. We got one Emercom survive. We got a graphics card. That's good. This is going to be needed for a part of our hideout. This is going to be needed for part of our hideout. These Poxrooms are needed for part of our hideout. 
got three there. I need to check these off as we get them, though, actually. I made a list. Okay. Um, I still need helixes. So we got the one. I think I just need a, I need a drill and two motors. For um, shooting range two. Okay. Elites have a ton of things. This one did labs key cards. Which I found interesting. But I think we're just gonna sell them. I'm not I'm not too worried about that. I can't like craft lab craft labs key cards for Founded Rage. These trade for healing. What do you trade for? These trade for a Mosin. They also trade for this guy. Um so maybe we'll start saving batteries. I don't think you do anything. Part of a weapon case barter, huh? It's motors, wires, broken LCDs, and an Asa. That's actually not terribly difficult. Well, it, it is difficult to get, but you can definitely get it. Then a motor. The motors are the hard part of that, is what I'm trying to say there. Might need that. Honestly, I think I'm just going to sell it, though, for now. Definitely need cords. That's for armors. Those are generally useful. Fascinating. We might need that. Oh, RPK trade's real good. Okay. Same for the RPK trade. That's for alpha containers. I think we have enough of those backed up. Keck tape's good. I don't think this trades for anything, and we have our yeah, we have our one we needed for the hideout done. Trades for clocks. No, we don't need the 303 key. Yeah. Not worrying about that. Okay. Let's do that. Hit that with a repair. We're going to sell all these. Including that. Think Ragman's taking any of that? No. Do we need money spent on Jaeger? Kind of. We'll toss him some stuff. We're actually pretty close to him being level 4, which is pretty cool. I actually don't know what we're going to do with this much money either. Like, we can't buy currency with it, so we can't just buy eye cases with it. Which is kind of funny. I actually sold them Amons because I'm trying to level up the dealers. So when you use that, when you use their their trading services, and I was trying to save room, but when you use their services, they, it levels them up, money spent wise. So for now, that's what we're doing. Um, but may end up doing that differently later. Okay. Back at it. See y'all, Raid. Okay. All right, well. Car's up again, but uh, this time we're going to hit this cash. Oh, we need to take Emmercom, so. Definitely want power banks. Okay, so there was lag, so that means Killa is not up. I actually don't think Killa was up last last uh, raid. Uh, power banks are pretty good. We can crap green batteries with them, which is nice. We need cords and capacitors and wires. Not what I meant to do. Pass all of what we need for the uh, actual uh, he, um, rest space too.
Yeah, I do still need contacts, so it's why filing cabinets are pretty good because we need matches and all that kind of stuff. Same old rules uh, at the end of the wipe do some crazy loadouts. I mean, we could, but if we do a secondary run. Um, we'll be able to buy loadouts. I don't, I've never, like, loved, like, million ruble loadouts. Was that not a headshot? This is, this is where contacts are so bad. I heard the shots, right? But I did not hear his footstep until he was in the door. Contacts are so powerful. And I should have been, like, I wish I was standing there. Bummer. GG. Yeah. Felt like a headshot to me. There's somebody... Oh, I meant to... Just check how many hits we got. Alright. Bummer, but GG. Um, hit that heal button. We could definitely wear this. Could wear that. Let me go look at my... Um, gun rack real quick. Okay, what do we got here? We got this RD. Which I don't think has a laser on it. We don't have that. Could bring in this thing. That is the inter interchange gun of choice. That doesn't have a... Uh, place for that. We really just don't have things with flashlights on them. Huh. Fascinating. Uh, I mean, this has a flashlight. But you know what? We got that. Funny enough, that actually might be a good gun for... Um, ooh, no. This will actually be a good gun for... Fighting in Resort. Alright. I was going to save that for... All that nonsense, but... It's fine. For office kills. Okay, but we could just do that. And then we're good there. All right. See you on right. These loadings are killing me. I can't even go take a normal break. My goodness. I, not that I should be complaining about fast load-ins, but like, holy smokes. That's nuts. Alright, goal. Fill up the blackjack. Really try to hear people coming, cause yeah, I think I think me not having contacts is definitely the number one reason I've been dying a lot the past few days. All good, Cynthia. Always one of the Goldilocks loadings. I just want to be able to take my break, you know? Go use the bathroom, fill up my water, start a new cup of coffee. You know, like, these are not too big of asks. All I need is a three-minute load-in. 
Yeah, it's true. It's ultra fast or five minutes. Yep, that's true. There's no such thing as a two and a half, three minute load in. It's either 90 seconds or nine minutes. It's exaggeration. I would never exaggerate, though. I don't think I'm turning on power. That would be interesting, where you could, like, choose to spawn in late. That would become, like, a meta, though. I feel like. Helix is spawn on those, so. Yeah, honestly. Alright, that's the last pox room we need um, to save. The, um... If we get two more helixes, we'll have, like... We'll have the booze generator going, which will actually be a huge deal. Ah, uh, because we do need Moonshine for the scav case, among other things. Moonshine's just really good. Things are going smoothly this wipe. I don't think booze was on the menu last time. Yeah, no. It, it, it's This wipe has been... Well, so here's the thing. episodic wise, it's hard to judge. I'd have, I'd have to go judge based off of, like, number of raids, I think. Like, I'd have to go look at the numbers from last wipe on that. I think I'm just going to skip that cash. Head across now. Because, um... We've been doing 30% longer episodes or whatever, you know. It's, but we've been doing an hour and a half to two hours instead of hour to hour and a half episodes. So, our episodes on average are much further. Now, that said, we, d we are accelerating, you know... I'm not brushing off, brushing off the rust. Um, I'm not playing catch up because we're playing in mono. Like there, there's a lot going for us this wipe as well. So I think it's those two combinations of things. So I'm so happy you're enjoying it in YouTube land. That makes me really happy. Um, elements. I think tomorrow, tomorrow Saturday, right? Obviously, this is no bearing on those watching on this YouTube right now, but you'll you'll have the recording that you can go watch. I think tomorrow we're going to go live with... on the YouTube channel. For... Um, the start of our Hatchet Challenge. And the reason I'm doing that is because i got to take a break after stream tomorrow morning. Because I'm going to get some lunch with some friends I haven't seen in a while. So I'm ending the stream early. So I want to you know, get some more content in. So. Right. Last last wipe I had a few weeks of audio issues. Our our start last time was rough. I'm not saying we've had wait, like the most amazing start ever. We've had a pretty good start. But we actually went down to zero guns at one point. And then like this is this is another one of our rough patches here. Like, not having contacts and needing to PvP and, you know. So, and that, that's that's just the, the, the life cycle of Tarkov. It has ups and downs, high swings, high lows, etc. You know. So... So, yeah, this is, this has been pretty good. Looking forward to the hatchet stream? I'm glad. And by hatchet stream, I mean we're just gonna play normal standard account with starting with just a hatchet. That's what I mean by hatchet stream.
Okay, I suck. Actually, really kind of need to leave now. I'm not even going to go loot that guy. We're just going to check check the open spawns here. Um but we're just we're just dipping. Because of this green battery, if we can get out of Emercom here, we'll have the hardest part of, of um, Rest Space 3. We're still going to need to go get other stuff. But the hard part will be done, which is really good. Comes the scaven now. Oh, and I just ran out of stamina. That's so bad. Okay, let's go here. Good morning, Twistle Mouse. How are you today? But yeah, I had I had like a whole elaborate rule set for the Hatchet Man challenge set up, but like we're already doing a bit of a rule set here, so I think I think just the simplicity of we're just starting a standard account with a hatchet. Um Hatchet in an alpha container, you know? I think it's totally fine. Good morning, Rush Code. Good morning, Holy Tear. Hello, hello. Cheers. Hope you're doing really well today, Holy Tear. And Rush Code. But I'm trying to think where we can get like the best amount of contact barters. Just a few options, like I mean, finally have this for matches is good, but the guitar pick and paper is also pretty good. But finally, have this kind of paper as well, so it's just like, yeah. Hard to say. Doing good, but Goose is sick. Trying to get work uh, out weather. I'm sorry to hear that. My goodness. He's your complicated kitty. My goodness. Well, I hope whatever it is can be... I don't want to say resolved. I just, you know, just... Uh, I hope whatever it is can be treated. Um, and Goose gets better. Okay, good. That's our daily. All right, good. Let's do that. Because now... Oh, yeah. We got the double battery. Nice. So let's go Let's go check our hideout real quick. Okay, so we just need cords, cords and capacitors. Because this one's in our inventory. So we're good. We're good there. So cords... Cords and capacitors, or one PSU to turn into capacitors. That said, I don't really want to do PSUs because I really need to save all the PSUs for this guy. So, um, yeah, and this one's here. So, that's pretty good. Like I said, those are the hard parts of that thing. I, I feel like we're saving a bunch of junk again. I mean, because we are. The question is, do we need these nails for anything? No. No. I might purge nails right now. We did need them for this, but that's that's already installing, so we don't care about that. No, definitely not for that. I mean, we'll check. No. Nope, just need the helixes for that. Do you need nails? No. Okay, so we can purge nails, actually. Or see what they... Um, required search? What do you do? You probably... Oh, just the sick case? Yeah, no, we can definitely purge nails here. That'll be good. I have a meeting to get this organized. We just have not. Hmm. The other thing is, we can really afford a fourth junk box and just start saving everything for all the stuff. 
I was keeping one of you. Oh, for that stupid thing? Yeah. Fair. Okay. What do you do again? Hmm. That, that barter for Jaeger. Oh, it's completed with a task, though. I don't need the money, though. That's the thing. Definitely keeping gunpowders. Submachine gun and an access card. I just don't see myself going to labs very much. I do want to start saving up for... Um, I do want to start saving up for... Oh, wow, why is my brain blanking on these things? My brain's totally blanking on this. Definitely need the metal parts. These are all good. I mean, just barters in general. Uh, yeah, we just need the helixes for that, so that's good to go. Maybe another... Oh, uh, I want to start saving up for another um, one of these guys. Let's do filter by item. How close are we? I need two hot rods. Four, one, four. It's actually not bad. We probably could do that in a raid. What do you do again? The Cordera is the hard part of that. We did get this whiskey recently, so we do actually have access to that. So we'll just do that, I guess. What do you do again? Done with that task. It's green battery plus two of those. So I think we're actually going to get rid of that. Uh, this one trades for grenades. Yeah, we'll keep that. Alpha container. What do you do again? Alto amount. That's definitely a useful trade later. And then this Glock. Just gonna get rid of that. Okay, purging the nails. This one has crafts though, not just trades. Is the thing about that? Like we can start crafting um cords with those, which is really nice. We actually officially officially filled that up. Okay, we might be buying another junk box here. This is, might be the time where we where we do that. Might be that time. Okay. All right, let's get rid of these things. And yeah, uh, chat pointed out that we really just don't need money right now, at all. So we can just kind of sell to whoever's buying that we don't have the appropriate amount saved up here. Regardless, you know, there's really no reason to do it any other way. We're good on money spent there. We just need a uh, rep with Peacekeeper. I do wonder if there's some good Peacekeeper barters that we could potentially do there. None of you want to clean, huh? silly uh, and then back I don't know what do we need with the flash drives I think craft stuff didn't know there was a thick item case trade for from peacekeeper interesting hey great Dane hope for it should as well as it can be expected as well as it can be expected yeah pretty pretty par for the course here which, honestly, I'll take. All right. So we did that daily. That was a really important daily to get done. I kind of want to go for, like, Comtac stuff. So let's look at let's look at our options here, Comtac-wise. We've got guitar picks, paper, and matches. And, like, looting them, obviously. We do have this barter now, which is nice. Uh, we could go for the Hollow Dilnik barter again. That would that would be nice. Save us a little room there. Need the alkali there. We need the wiper fluid for a task. Hmm. No, no. We we have a bunch of woods tasks to do still. Even though we did like lots of good work on woods, we still need. Oh, I need nine more kills. I thought I needed eight more. 
even though we did, did do that a lot, we still have some stuff to work towards here. We definitely need to get factory kills going. Could 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 work on that. I don't really have too many kits to lose. I will say this factory is a good place to not have. Like we could do that. And honestly, that. Kind of go full PvP mode here. And just see what we can't do. I don't hate that idea. Uh, I definitely want to switch this up, though, if we're going to do that. Honestly, I think I'd rather protect my stomach and... Uh, hmm. This is where I need the Karun. Oh, we can see if the Karun's available. Uh, let's put that on. Because if we have a Karun barter available, this will be good. Sold out. Always sold out. Uh, 25 minutes for that, huh? Dang. And what are the level 5s do we have access to? Or even just level 4s. I just level, Sorry, level 4s that protect the stomach is the big deal here. That doesn't protect the stomach. This one technically protects the stomach. So does that. But... Oh, that's actually not a bad one. It's like slightly bigger than the, uh, the scav backpack size. Hmm. I have that, but we need to save those. Garcia with the 15 months. Thank you so much, Garcia. I think I'm just going to wear this level 4. And hopefully we can get a level five later. I mean, we could we could repair this and use it. I don't know. But we could also wear this. You know what? Let's wear that. We'll uh, we'll we'll cosplay this guy real quick. I did forget we had this. Just do this, this, this. All right. Very good. I'm not going to put the hat on. We could put the hat on, but I'm not going to put the hat on. I'm going to hit that with a mechanic repair. Because I want that to be as high durability as possible. Um, okay. We're going to do that. And then load into these. And then what I'm gonna also going to do is we're going to get a laser. Instead of a... Um, something with a laser on it instead of just a flashlight. Perfect. And grenades. And then all of our healings there. That's fine by me. Okay. Let's hop in there. I'll see you later. All right, here we go. Here we go. So we actually need like stuff from the safe up top as well, which is pretty cool. So there's like good loot in the office area, which is really nice. Let's try to get over there before bumping in everybody. Garcia with the gifted sub. Thank you so much. Four underscore Garcia underscore four gifted a tier one sub to John Rambo. Fian. Thank you. Thank you. Missed. How does how is he not dead? I'm 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 dead. How is he not dead? I just man, I don't know, chat. 
I don't know. I'm missing. I, I'm just clearly missing. GG. Uh, and I messed up both my grenades. How is he not dead? I only got four hit. Okay, yeah, I, I was very clearly missing. Got it. Okay, no problem. All right, we're going to use this thing. If I can get it going proper here. Oh, come on. Yeah, I got to go back and look at that, but I'm pretty sure I just missed a ton. Uh, and that's on, like, that's on me, but it feels like I'm hitting them a lot, which is a unfortunate, unfortunate thing. Uh, we have a bit of SMB. Honestly, the T46M is where I want to be at, I think. And then, yeah, we'll put you on six. We'll put this here. I guess I don't have the, um, hmm. And I missed my grenades. That was really the big thing. Is like if I had put a grenade down the end of that hallway, that fight's completely different. But I kept I kept missing my grenades, so I'm very clearly off in some way, and that's okay. These things happen. Um. Yes. I could bring the key in. I guess we don't really care about this. Is there a barter for... I think there probably is. I think if I do this, though, we'll have enough time to get out there. And I do actually want the key, because I would really like to survive one of these. So, all right, let's um do that again. What's up, Tony? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. What's this game about? This game is about... Hold on. Up top there? Did I just see them go up top there? Maybe. Why are you searching? Let's do this. I need that balaclava. Is that... Pretty sure that's Tagilla. Is he coming for me? This gun could take on Tagilla, so. Oh, that's so frustrating. But we got to Gila, I guess. Oh, man. What the timing of that, though? Like, I think that was a player scav behind me. I think. But then this guy turns around. And, like, we get the kill, but it's just like, oh, come on. Man. GG. I just, that's, that's the other thing is we've been getting so unlucky these past few days. Like, if that scav's not coming behind me, I can hold the corner there, try to get the kill on the guy at the end of the office, then I can turn around and loot Tagilla, but, like, also, I think Tagilla had slugs on, which is such unfortunate, you know? And it's just, like, the player kill I got was not in the office, which sucks. So, no, I know I killed Tagilla. I know. Just, man, that really sucks. So that's that. So we got to remember the first death was me sucking. The, that death was just unfortunate timing. I would, I actually played that well, I think. You know? So that's how it goes. All right. I need contacts. I need to change up what we're doing here. Let's go to Woods. Let's go to Woods and try to figure this out.
maybe even like nighttime woods try to get some good loot going i don't even know if, i guess woods has guitar picks for what we need but what do i need what did i need to do on woods there was something else i need to do on woods maybe i did finish up all all the stuff i needed to do on woods here hold on let me let me look here i guess i did kind of finish a lot of those up there's like Len Lease. Oh, I forgot to do this on it. Maybe we're going interchange, honestly. And like, let's go. Maybe maybe we go interchange and finish up. Finish up our. Um, hideout stuff. Hey, Alexander, how are you? But yeah, like, why was that scav rushing behind me, though? That's the weird part. I, I, I'm I, almost positive it was a player scav. Oh, I guess we do need more weapons parts. Okay. But I would like to get this going. So let's get a drill. Let's get motors. And get this thing going. Because then by the time that's done and that's done, we can really work on weapon stand, too. Okay. Let's do that. Because I need to do something that's not task that involves killing players. Because clearly when I'm trying to kill players, I can't kill players. That is very clearly how that's working. Um, that's for a gunsmith. Let's just use this silly thing. Uh, I would really like to have a flashlight, though. So maybe I'm actually going to use this. And that has a flashlight, so let's just do that. Modding. Let's just bring in that. And that. And we don't need this. Don't really need that. I would like those two. I would like this guy. I would like problem with doing the heavy bleed bars we're gonna need a lot of screws here but we're, we're gonna be we're gonna be trading for those so that's fine let's actually do that trade oh i'm out of ewrs as well man i am chewing through everything dang that's really unfortunate let's actually do that one instead then chewing through everything we'll do that i really need to get a um what's its face Alright, that'll do. I really need to get myself a um injector case. But anyway, interchange. Uh I am gonna go nighttime here. Uh just try to avoid players, hopefully. And I'm gonna go mark that last minibus, try to get this Kibba thing down, try to loot some contact somewhere. Um look at all the gold spawns, look at all well, not all. We're you know, we're gonna play our spawn, but um, and we do, and we do want money this time because we don't care about leaving through other places. And uh, yeah, we really need to get some contacts, man. I will see you on raid. All right, Chad, I gotta get, I gotta take a quick break here. I really gotta pee, so I'll be right back. Get yourselves, come drink, get a snack, come a break. Stay tuned. More fun to come.
Hey, look at that. Perfect timing on that one. Oh my gosh, that one was recording the whole time. Well, I'm either going to leave that in or I'm going to uh, have to edit later. <laughs> Probably have to edit that one later. What are we on, 57? Needs cut. Uh, probably one of the worst spawns for this. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna get underground, though. I think. Go for this mini bus. Fix it in post. Yeah, the whole reason I record this way is so I don't have to do post stuff. Uh, that said, these episodes wouldn't be that much different. I do think this is genuinely. A really fun way to experience Tarkov. Uh, personally. I don't remember if there was lag or not. Power's on, though. That's good to know. Um, that's like in the back of Ollie, so I'm really happy I didn't go there. I was going to say, the... I think that's one of the best parts about this. Now, Minecraft stuff would get a lot better if I did a lot more post-editing, you know? In post-editing. But I don't think I want to be an editor, you know? Like I, I've learned a lot. I know how to do a lot of basic stuff. I just... It doesn't do it for me. I don't get that same excitement. I, I like it when the videos are received well. But... I have to have a particularly large amount of extra time to get motivated to do that. I think that's okay. I think I'm going right the right way underground here, but I could be wrong. Yeah, this is the right way. That's the hole in the wall up ahead. Which I need to go out into the right to mark this thing. I really need to get Comtex. I think this is one I've marked already. Was weird. No, no worries, Tony. All good. I hope you're doing really well. Seriously, thanks for thanks for being here. I appreciate you hanging out. My god, that site's horrible. <laughs> Don't worry, there's a red dot. Very silly. Okay. Is this not the... Okay, I was going to say, I'm pretty sure this is the last one we need to plant. For specifically minibus. I don't think there's any other markers we need to do on this map. Just the Kiba store. Just don't ADS. I mean you you know I love not ADSing and shooting. It's like my favorite thing. 
I do it too much, actually. But boy, does it look cool as hell when you when you do it right, though. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right. What's the other thing I need to do? I, we just need the parts. I really need to go to the tech stores, but it sounds like there's a lot of people doing that already. And that's my other goal, is to avoid everything. Power station's already been used. Okay. I actually don't like the ghost ring. Like the ring site, I, I much prefer... Okay, that's in the idea office. I am not from Canada, no. A lot of people, uh, a lot of people think that though. My buddy, uh, Serge, who I played a, a lot of Minecraft, um, servers with, he, uh, he genuinely thought I was from Canada for the longest time. Too bad. I mean, I'm still me. Just because I'm not from Canada. <laughs> you know? I guess that's the reason. Kind of look like it. I mean, you get a lot of Midwesters with the backwards hat type of look. I don't always have a backwards hat on, so to be fair. The nice and play part of NJ. I mean, it exists. Just don't tell anybody because I don't want people here. All right. Are we going up or not? Um, I think not. We might go back to the, the hole in the floor here. And trying to walk up calmly and quietly to Kiba. I, I'm not really sure how a beard and a mustache look Canadian, but fair enough. I can assure you, Tony, I'm Canadian. I have neither. Nice. We know how difficult those are to get. It's nice knowing that Killa can't be down here. Let's go get this Wi-Fi camera down. Hopefully. Let's got somebody else. No, no. You yell at somebody else. Congrats on the Omega Sword. From uh, a champion. That's awesome. I'm here. Heck yeah. Alright, dope. Shh. 
Sure. Only because it's kind of free. I'm actually going to bring that because I'm actually running out of ammo. And then those are all good. These are like whatevers. That's a player. Upstairs, if I had to guess. Can we stop coughing? I so hey, wanted to, I so wanted to kill him. <laughs> ah, I love punishing people who are like that. GG's. GG's. I should have brought out the other gun. Oh, but I mean, it was, what do I want to do? A pistol versus that? Uh, classic. Also, I muted there cuz I don't care to listen to that. <laughs> Well, we got our stuff down, which is good. What the hell is that scope? That is a G36 scope, and it's horrendous. It is horrendous. <laughs> GG, though. Oh, man. My back is not happy right now. No, I did that task already this morning. I'm trying to survive because I need... <laughs> I need to get my... My... Uh, <laughs> whatever you want to call it back. We've been getting absolutely slaughtered today. Um, and I just need loot. But we did get these tasks down, which is nice. I think Ragman does have you survive, though. <sighs> yeah. So we could go, like, do these two real quick. You know? Mojo, yeah, whatever you want to call it back. I don't want to say confidence, because I'm confident in myself right now. It's just like, the luck is just out of this world. That does unlock chumming, which is real nice. You know, chumming is a good one to have access to. But no, I don't need to. I Oh, I see. You, that's what you meant by that. We need to survive to get that done. I got you. Yeah. Yes, technically, yes. Uh, let's do that. No, let's do... I almost want to do like a zero to hero just so I don't have anything to risk here, you know? So let's do that. Let's bring in a 226. Let's give it at least reasonable ammo. Um, I think I might have another 226 mag. I'm not, it's not pure zero to hero here, right? But like I want to do a little bit of a two of a zero to hero here. Um Let's get a flashlight on this. And then let's get like this on. And like that's the kit. Maybe maybe we're even ditching these. And just putting that there. Or maybe we'll do it we'll do it this way. I we do need extra bullets. I want extra bullets. Oh actually no that we could do that. We could do that this way. We could do the extra bullets that way, and then maybe put a propotol there. Okay. Now, our goal here is to 
Get in. Get the books, get out, depending on our spawn. Or get in, wait, get out, depending on the book spawn. Or depending on where we spawn. Alright, here we go. Hell spawn is this? Like one of the worst spawns possible. All right. Um. I mean, I need to get to the center of the mall. I need to get. I. I think of. All right. There's lag, so no killer. That's good. So I think what we're gonna do is um. Yeah. Just head over center. I, I don't know if this is the fastest way possible or not. And I do actually genuinely forget where the where the second book is. It's downstairs, I think. Yeah, store next to Evercom, which, oh, man, that kind of makes me want to, like, let the raid do its thing. Because if we let the raid do its thing, somebody might open that for us. Oh, that's no, 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 no! Stop, 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 stop! I forgot I had that out. All right. Well, now we need to leave. There's not really that many med spawns not behind keys on this map. Alright. Uh, use that so you can shut up. Sh you need to shut up, dude. Thank you. That'll heal us up. Just gonna beeline for extract here because I don't have a stomach. Once again. One of the main reasons I one of the main mechanics I don't like in hardcore is that like just never having a CMS. It's super frustrating. have I guess we'll have this to eat. Okay, now we can use this. It's unfortunate to be line here, but especially when there's shots going on over there. It's kind of annoying.
I think there's a few med spawns in here, but like I said, it's so rare that you get even like a painkiller on these. happen like right there so if we if we do a, like a wide kind of loop into railway here we should be okay that's kind of what i'm hearing yeah i'm not going to the upper floor with a blacked out stomach in the hopes that i find a see a biscuit Not after the day we've been having. You, you, you usually get optimistic, Pine. Not today. Today we got pessimistic, Pine. And he's angry, kind of. Not really. Angry for Pine. Level ye old metabolism. And then what we're going to do... The heck? Is we're going to run through this construction area. There's one jacket here. This is what, this is how it's going to go. We're going to loot this jacket. This jacket is going to have an Emercom medical unit key in it. And we're going to put that in our inventory. Then we're going to extract. We're going to heal. And then we'll have an Emercom medical key unit. It's going to be great. Just you watch. <coughs> exactly. Say it, manifest it. I really need you to stop coughing. Hey, so that one stopped the coughing immediately. The heck, man. I don't even think the jacket spawned. <laughs> oh, look. Vitamins. It might be this this, this one. Okay, it is this one. It is this one. Okay. Alright, here it is. Evercom medical key. I'm going to be called a hacker if it's actually the case. Bam! Oh, we tried. We tried. Never did. That was on single fire. Okay. That would have been awkward. That would have been real awkward. I can't, I can't even see there, let alone with the flashlight on. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Win. All right, we're out. Got to survive. I've got two, two level four armors. Not just one. Two. Feels good. GG's. Sometimes you just need a little bit of a win. Why is my music not playing? It is. Just needs to be skipped. Okay. Yeah. That one scav was a pain in the booty, but you know what? That's okay. All right, now how do we get all of this stuff away, I guess, is the question. And we do have this this AK grip. Let's just put a flashlight on a, on a decent rifle, which is real nice. So I might even, like, put it on this guy. Yeah. I think we're good on this thing, right? Yeah, so we're good. We're good. So anything outside can be sold. Which is nice. Let's put that away. I don't need these things. That's pretty good. That's definitely really good. Sure. Put that there. Okay. 
Just gonna do that real quick. Guess I had a lot of space in here. Those can be sold. That can get sold. Okay, this gun could be the gunsmith gun. Does need to be 60% or more, I think. Which is pretty cool. Then what we can do is just pop all this stuff over onto here. Uh, we're still going to keep this AK, but... As, but like I'd rather use this AK at 100% than, and save this one for the gunsmith, you know what I mean? So we're going to put those on there. Alright, we'll get that going nicely soon. This needs to get sold. This needs to get sold. FMJs aren't terrible. They're not great, but they're not terrible. Put that there. Sell, sell, sell. Sure. Uh, we're really far away from Ragman 3, so I think I'm going to still keep selling those. Okay, you're good, you're good. I think we can sell, afford to sell that. I think we can afford to sell that. Perfect, that can go there. These trade for um, Propital, which is real nice. Keeping that there. We can just keep those there. Put that there. We do 4,700 is our number these days. Keeping that. Got to keep this for later. I, I know it stinks dying now to headshots, but we got to keep those for later. That actually barters well. We're going to drink that one first. Um... Do that. Did actually run out of the space for these things. Interesting. Good morning, Samak. How are you today? All right, that's getting sold. We'll keep that on. Hit this with a nice repair. Or nicer repair with skier. Okay, those are all good. We're going to repair this one. Rather spend a pile of meds and a little bit of fuel. Personally. And then honestly, we just have a couple of these. Let's use these. Let's do six. Uh, let's do that in there, though. And I think those are all still good. Yeah, sure. We can put that on there. Why not? These come down in here. No, they don't because we've used those. We could, um, I guess Chumming does have this plant the gold chains thing, right? Could do that. It is kind of near where we need to get the books, the bookstore stuff. Hmm. I don't know about that. We'll see. We'll see. Let's put that there. Let's put that there. A better muzzle. I think this one's better. Definitely replacing this with something smoother. I think I would like to save those. I think we'll do Cobra for that. I am actually running out of mags for this. Uh, you know what we can do? We could do this. just make sure I didn't do that too many times. I think we're good, but I do got to make sure that when we get out with these helixes, which we are still looking for, that we can um, get the thing done here. Okay, we only need two there, and I'm pretty sure we have like six or seven, but I, that's the la this is the last 60 rounder I'm going to trade for for a while, until we get that done, I think. Um, so let's just do that. Yeah. Yeah. Then we'll do that. We'll do that. And honestly, we'll do that. Put you on four. Put that there and then top that up. And that should be enough. 
And then we'll have this pistol for the um, scavs. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Which one of these skier things gave us the NVGs? There's a task here that gives this. Is it that gives us these NVGs? Is it Len Lease? It's Len Lease. Okay. Yeah, that one's tough to do. Um, cause this one's behind 112 on shoreline. And we don't have that, so. I think we I think we only care about this part of chumming. The red the gold chains are easy enough to do post, you know. We just don't need to worry about that. Alright, YouTube, that is out of recording time though. Um I that was a success enough for me. I was considering just swapping over to the, the other stuff. But I, I'm, mo I'm motivated to keep going here, so we're going to record another episode. We got this. I I have faith in us. Um, we got a little bit of toe in the door there with uh, some armors. We're going to hop back on their change. Again, we're really just searching for... Oh, we can complete minibus too here. Um, we really are just searching for... Um... Oh, minibus doesn't unlock anything. Well, there you go. I could have swore. So we need the books is what we need. Am I wearing a bag? I guess I'm wearing a bag. Um, anyway, yes, good. Okay, good. Um, yeah, but we'll hop on an interchange raid. We have our flashlight now. We might, we might do nighttime for the chumming part. Um, also just hopefully less players, but we got to go get those books. We've got to go, um, we're looking for drills and motors, which is the tech stores. We're looking for PSUs as well. Technically, uh, we're looking for, um, yeah, just survives. We're looking for survives. We're going to, you know, get in, get out, get get what we have out. I'm going to sell up all this stuff in, in between episodes here. Uh, make a little room in our stash. Uh, we're looking for balaclavas to take onto Shoreline. We're looking for... Uh, there's a lot of stuff we're looking for here. So, um, unfortunately, I don't think these count as a ba balaclava. But we also need these for the pack of barters later anyway. So, yeah. Really good stuff. We got it. Like I said, we got our toe in the door there. Um... This happens every wipe. This happens to be every single wipe, I think, around these tasks where I'm just like, where I specifically need player kills, I get worse at PvP. So we're going to pretend not to be PvPing. And if it happens to you, don't worry about it, you know? Just, it's the same exact thing. Yeah. Put it down. Do something else. Go on a scav run. If you're not playing normal, go on a scav run. Reset. And maybe that's what we'll do with our, we'll finally go on our first scav run here uh, just to reset ourselves. Um, follow our original rules. I don't know. Again, it's... When I do my first scavenger, it's going to be based on what I'm feeling at the in the moment. So, um, yeah. Anyway, I am rambling. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for being a patron. Thank you for sharing your Twitch Prime in the Twitch chat. That's a big deal. And we'll catch you next episode.